The Nexus 5 is one of Google's latest and greatest devices. However, battery life is quite poor. Hey guys, it's Techline here, back with another tutorial showing you how to improve battery life on the Nexus 5. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and start to change a few things. Uh, go into Wi-Fi and click the menu button and then advanced and disable scanning always available and avoid poor connections and leave Wi-Fi optimization on. Now we're going to go into location settings and either you can leave it on or off. Off will save the most battery, but when you do leave it on, there are multiple modes for you to choose from. Again, battery saving is the obvious choice here and we can go back. Again, back, and we're gonna open up Advanced Task Manager. Uh, you can download this on the Play Store, and click Menu, Settings, and then scroll down to Auto Kill. Uh, now there are multiple options for you to choose from. I like to leave it at aggressive and auto kill frequency do it to when screen turns off. So whenever your screen turns off, you're going to get better standby times as your device isn't running unnecessary processes. So now I'm going to enable art, which is found in developer options. Scroll all the way down and in select runtime, just select art and this pre-compiles code so you get better performance and standby times, but the first boot will take a long time. So now we are in the root portion of the video. Uh, we're going to need the Carbon ROM, which has a bunch of battery saving features, and the Charizard X kernel, which we are going to modify later on. All right, so now we're gonna change a few settings in Carbon ROM. Open up settings and go into Carbon Fibers. From there, we're gonna open up interface and battery saver mode, which is right there. Scroll down into network modes and for normal network mode, you can set it to whatever you like. And this is the network they're gonna be using when you're actually using the device. And power saving mode is, again, your preference. Again, 2G is gonna save the most uh, power. So you're gonna set it to when screen turns off, make sure that is checked. And now we're going to go into Trickster mod kernel settings and we're going to uh, undervolt the CPU which saves power but still delivers the same performance. So again we're going to go all the way back, we're going to go all the way back to uh, general which is right there and you're going to set uh, the IO control to 2048 and Zen and the CPU frequency control to again whatever you like. The lower the frequency the more power you're going to save. So I'll include that at 1.5 gigahertz it still saves enough power and go to governor control and we're going to change a few settings here. I'll leave the full profile in the description down below but again this is what you should have. Uh, you're going to apply the settings and here we're going to change the multi-core power setting to 2 the GPU governor interactive and again the frequency to 150 lower again saves more power and now here's where you change the values again you switch up the values to a lower number so it still delivers the same frequency but again it saves more power as it's using uh, less voltage so that's pretty much it for the kernel settings okay so we have angry birds go running right now again at the uh, profile that i've set so 1.5 gigahertz max with uh, 156 megahertz max uh, gpu and you can see that gameplay is still really smooth uh there isn't much stutter at all and lag is minimal so even with these lower settings you can still get uh, a really uh, nice experience out of your device without sacrificing or compromising too much so as you can see here these are the uh, full battery results i got five and a half hours of screen on time on a full charge and i got three hours with 55 percent still remaining and you can see here that standby times are really really good you can see barely any battery loss at all and that's pretty much it. If this video helped you guys out, be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe to the tech line. We'll see you in the next video.